Welcome, everyone, to part one of Jack Ship was 31 Days of Spooky. Gonna be playing a horror game, or have a horror game video come out every day of October this year. I think it's gonna be fun. We're starting off with Born into Fear. I played the demo for this uh, about a year ago at this point, and the game came out a few months ago. Unfortunately, I didn't get a chance to play it, but I figured, hey, it's October, let me, let me play it finally. But this game looks amazing, and looks horrifying, and has mannequins, and I hate that. So yeah, let's play. Slot, that's terrifying. Why Why would that be your loading screen? I hate that. I hate that so much. Please load faster. Okay, cool. Alright, cool, 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 cool. Oh, sweet, dude. Okay. What's up? Alright, so I, so I gotta go beat up Sally. Uh, look with right click. What is that? Okay. Man, why, why you got, uh, my got creepy eyes there, dude. Yeah, you're, uh, is it too late to, like, not play this game? I really just want to stop. What's, what's this note? Unfortunately, the neighborhood has become much more dangerous since your last visit. Surveillance of North Hollow Heights has shown new variants of Sally roaming the suburb. We've yet to see these new variants in action, so we can only theorize about their abilities. Attached are a few of the photos we've managed to capture regarding these new Sally forms. Terrifying. I don't want to deal with it. Oh, it's a... Okay, so that, that's a safe thing. What, what's this letter? Agent J. Great work yesterday, Agent. With the intel we've gathered thanks to your actions, we've concocted a plan to deal with the buffer known as Sally. You're being sent in the area again, but this time you'll be striking for the source of the buffer's power. House 117. As far as we can tell, Sally has claimed this home as her base of operations. However, it won't be as simple as just walking up to the house. Odds are likely that Sally has enacted some sort of protection guard against intruders. With our limited understanding of her powers, we suggest you investigate some of the houses in the area for a means to destroy the barrier. Detect her presence at these houses. 102, 106, 107, 111, 111, blah, 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 blah. Numbers. Searching the may yield a solution 117's barrier. Dope. Uh, how <laughs> about just, just labeled sedan? S sedan. Sit down. Ooh, origami. Is this drink just called Buff? It's called Buff Fizzy Drink. I want that. Got got some Fritz. Why don't I just stay here? Like that. This seems pretty chill. All right, let's let's uh let's get the hell out of here. Stop with this loading screen. I hate it. I hate this loading screen already, man. Not even not even playing the game yet, and the loading screen creeps me out. I hate that. Definitely don't want to be here. Listen, I'm about to just go straight to her house and just like punch this man. Wait, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. What's that? What's that? That is definitely a thing standing in the middle of the, of the road. Is it moving? Yo, it's it's moving. Ah, dude. Oh, hold on, hold on. No, no, we we gotta get, get gotta get rid of this thing. Hold on. Yeah, it is definitely standing there. Oh, oh. It is wiggly. Can can we just not, dude? Oh, oh. Ah, ah, ah. Ah, uh, why, why, nope, okay. We out, we out, guys. I'm getting back to my car and we're leaving. I'm going home. Back off, Sally. I'll punch you in the face. I'm just going to walk backwards all the way to my car. Totally going to work out. Totally going to work out. Can we leave? Can we leave? Can we leave? Oh, <laughs> actually, I'm going to leave. <laughs> And that is how you guys get the secret ending of the coward ending. Because I totally meant to do that. I didn't run away because I was scared. Nope. That is hysterical. They basically just straight up call you a coward for running away. <laughs> That's awesome, dude. All right. Get back into it. <laughs> I can't go over that. All right. We already looked through all this stuff last time. Oh, I have to read the briefing. Oh, okay. Hold on. Let's do this really quick. What was that? All right, briefing is red. All right, let's go. Okay, so don't walk towards the mannequins being all creepy. I'm just going to focus on the houses at the start this time. Okay, all right. Remember, Agent, you won't be able to access the creature's lair to destroy right. it until you 
search for the house is marked in your read. All right, all right. One hundred two was one hundred two. One of them. Can I, can I get in here? All right, guys. First house. Do, do I not have a flashlight right now? What the? Put all my white balls back in your cases, or you're going to lose your phone for the next week. Oh, and white balls. Why do I? Have that? Nope. All right, uh, it's, oh, dude, okay, um, do I have any form of flashlight or, like, items or anything? Bro, why didn't you come here with a flashlight? At least you have a map. Oh, that scared the hell out of me. Okay. All right, oh, okay. All right, uh, well, what, what, uh, dude, she said, like, put stuff away. All right, hold on, hold on, we're, we're gonna save really quick. All right, I know she said put the chairs back where they belong. Oh, okay, so these are, like, the highlighted spots, so I've got to find the chairs and put them here. All right, so ketchup. Oh, hell yeah, dude. Freaking, wait, ketchup? You should put that in the fridge, dude. Really? Oh, what the f- <laughs> Stop! Stop it. I just wanted to put the ketchup in the fridge. No. <laughs> okay, all right. There we go. We, we put a chair. We're going to clean up this mess. We're, we're going to clean up this mess for her. Okay. Let's, uh... uh... All right. So I got to get the wine bottles in the wine cabinet, dude. I'm literally just appearing here and cleaning up the damn house. Yeah, this is, uh... This sounds great. It's fantastic. You know, I, I got to clean my own house, but not, uh... I want to clean a spooky mannequin's house who always jumps at me and yells at me. Oh, that's cool. It shows the... It shows what you need up there. With a little star. All right. another chair. Let's scooch this over this way. All right, we're good. All right, I think we got all the chairs. Let me scoop up some more wine bottles. Well, at least those chairs. I gotta find the the little uh, bar stool chair. Yeah, uh, three wine. I gotta find one more wine bottle. All right, well, there's the last wine. Is that another ketchup bottle? Oh no, it's safe. <laughs> I'm gonna be terrified of ketchup now. There we go. All right, so all the wine bottle. Wait. I thought I, I thought I found a lot more wine bottles than that. Are they still in my inventory? No. Nah. Hmm. Alright, well, I thought I found all the wine bottles. I swear, if she jumps out of nowhere, man, like... Why is there a wine bottle in the bathroom? I mean, alcoholics in here, dude. To be fair, though, like, you know, a, a nice warm bath with, you know, a glass of wine does sound pretty relaxing. Hello? Oh, wine ball on the washing machine? You know, I'm not gonna judge. I was hoping I, like, turned the lights on or something. What was this? No, I'm not gonna worry about that. Was there, was there another door here? No, it was just the end of the hallway. Okay. Alright, well, I got enough wine bottles. Let me go put these back. I think I have, like, two on me right now. Oh, yeah, there are only three in there. There we go. That's not all five. Five. Oh, there are eight wine bottles and five chairs. Where's the one chair there? Where's the other chair go? Unless there's something like upstairs. Why does this house got to have three floors, man? And why does nobody have lights on? Just, come on, man. Pay your electric bill. What's that? Oh, that's that's so nice. downstairs. Why, why would you bring a bar stool upstairs? Like, don't you have chairs up there, dude? Like, what, what was this? I think I can throw items. Yeet. No, nope, I just dropped it. Hold on. That's not a throw. That's just dropping. Go. Where did where does the last chair go? I don't see a spot for the last chair unless it, unless there's like a spot up here that I need to bring it to. I, I just walked by and saw that tree out the window. I thought it was a uh, another mannequin. It scared me. Why the door open this way? Oh, that's not horrifying at all. What was what, what this? What, what was this? I, yeah, I, I think we have to, we definitely got to touch it. But Doctor Caleb. Oh, great! It's one of the murderers. 
Never killed anyone. You might not have pulled the trigger, Agus Goon, but you killed me sure enough. What, what are you talking about, man? It's bad enough I had to deal with you while I was alive, but do you have to hound me in death, too? I'm sorry about what happened to you, but Agus needs the power to protect the world. Your sacrifice won't be forgotten. How are you here if you're dead? Shouldn't you, I don't know, be in the afterlife or something? Yeah. Anything that says continue, I'm just going to click that. I'm not sure how this works either. My daughters both died that night along with me, but I can't sense them anywhere. There's no way I'm leaving this place until I know where to find them. Is there any way I can help? I think there might be. At our house number 102 on the street, there's a book in the kids' room. I read to my daughters every night for months after her mother died. Work eventually caught up to me, and I never found the time to read to them again. That's sad. If you could find that book and bring it back to me, it might lead to my kids. Please, I need to find them. This is house 102, right? See what I can do about making promises. Nah, I'll, I'll help you. You're a good guy. I wish there'd been more like you that night. Thank you. Aw. Alright, so not only are we trying to kill a psycho murderer mannequin, we're gonna help out Dr. Caleb's over here. Is, is, uh, we're gonna figure out his soul and help him, you know, get back in touch with his kids. But I'm pretty sure this is house 102. I did not like the sound of that. I got home. <laughs> I hate this game. <laughs> okay. Alright, go and go and go up up to up to the stairs. This is probably where the kids' room is, right? I need I need to find their book. I just, just want to read it. Alright, we got a chair that goes there. Okay, that's that's where the last chair goes. Why, why is there a wine ball up here too? Is this the this kid's room? It's probably the kid's room. She's probably gonna jump out of me, isn't she? She's probably gonna jump out. She's probably in here just like hanging out, isn't she? Yeah, this is this is actually a dope room. This actually looks really cool. Ah, uh, here's the chair. I, I'm not gonna grab that yet. I wanna find their book. There we go. I, th I think that was the book they need, right? I hope that my inventory is just three wine bottles. What's that? Hidden note. Ooh. I hate, hate, hate that and B. If she ever threatens Olivia again, she'll regret it. I miss mom. Aw. Trying to not read certain words so that YouTube doesn't get mad at me. Let's see. I think I think I got the book. I think that was the book there. I don't know. I'm too too panicky to fully remember what I grabbed. Right, let's put the last chair here. What was this do? Is she gonna pop out? All right, let me go talk to uh, let me go talk to Dr. Caleb again. Give him this book. Hopefully, not have her jump out at me again because I don't don't deal with that. Hey, dude, I got your book. Help the others too, please. Whoop, my wrong button. All right, cool. So I guess our side goal is to help all these lost souls. Which hey, I'm game for that. I like helping people. Please, Sally, listen, listen, listen. Just don't. Don't jump out at me when I come down here. Just, please. I'm gonna, I'm gonna save, then I'm gonna put the wine bottles away, and that should be the last, uh... The last quest for down here. I, I'm, I'm prepping myself. She's gonna jump out at me and, and try to spook me. Alright, last one, last one, last one, last one. Oh. Alright, I think we're good. I, all right, all right. Uh, yeah. I hate you. I hate you so much. Maybe grow peaceful after all. <laughs> I hate this game. I need to pick up the gold. I need to pick up the gold star. Oh, dude, guys, I got a gold star. Oh, yay. Hell yeah. Look at that. That makes me happy. <laughs> all right, let's get out of here. I guess it's a, it's a beautiful night sky. All right, so one house is completed. What what was this? One on one? Okay. What what's in one on one? Can I get in here? I don't want to go inside, but that's it's it's for for the game. Gotta play the game. All right, Sally, where are you, you butthole? Got a new journal entry. And close the door because I'm not a hooligan. I just word hooligan. What's wrong with me? All right, one on one. Jefferson Family Home. Agent Blue's notes from the operation tell me a family of three lived here. There might be something I overlooked my first night here. Otherwise, this house is non-essential. Well, I'll take a, take a gander. 
I just heard something, right? Like, I'm not going crazy. I absolutely heard something. I heard a noise. Am I just going crazy? I, I don't know, man. This game is, uh... <laughs> I definitely heard that. Nope. <laughs> uh, hold, on, hold, on, hold on. What's, uh... Can I, can I see through the windows? I kind of want to, like, peek in the windows, see if I can see him up there. Oh, that's horrifying. It's just, all oh, the feet, dude, the feet, the walking. Oh, I hate it, I hate, I hate, okay. Alright, 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 alright. Be, uh, be, be strong, be strong. Be strong. Not gonna have something jump out of these open doors at me. Ooh, laptop. Alright, what, what was in the store? Alright, so... I guess the main thing that would be here was maybe there's another one of those souls. I can open the fridge. Hell yeah, dude. Wait, we got snacks in here. Got some uh, some eggs. What was this? Waffles. Oh, dude, do you guys want waffles? Can I crouch in this game? I don't think so. Oh yeah, I can. Got some meat. Some apples. Dude, we can have a whole uh, whole meal. What's that? That looks like something I should read. Is there anything on the laptop? Yeah, it sounds about right. I, I would follow its advice. Okay, um, can I pick this up? What was this? World news. Everything's going down. Okay, that sounds about right, too. Um, got that stuff. What's this? Ooh, origami. I guess these are collectibles. Okay. What was that door done there? What, what's in here? Nothing. Okay, I can't open that door. I guess I gotta go upstairs though. <laughs> Fuck it off! Oh my god, why? Uh... They shut the door on me too. What a what a jerk, dude. <sighs> Alright, upstairs. Let's go. I'm gonna close this. Come on, let's do this. Where are you, man? I'll punch you in the face. Alright, you're not in there. Stop opening doors that way. I don't see any glowy uh, orb like the other room yet. I hate that that tree looks like a limb. Like a like an arm. Oh. What is this? Child's bird drawing? Aw. Family's child drew his pet bird. Oh, that bird. Anything on back? I get lights up where you can actually, you know, examine things. Hello? Alright, well, there's nothing else here except for that creepy mannequin dude. So, I'm gonna just leave. Like, we out. Just gonna run straight for the door. Yep. Uh, done. Alright, alright. All right, two houses down. We, we cleared 102 and we cleared 101. I think that's a good spot to stop the first part. So, uh, hopefully I survive playing this game. We'll see. If you don't already, heed the laptop's, you know, advice. Hit the subscribe button. And look forward to the next part during Jack Shippo's 31 Days of Spooky. Bye.